Dave, what did you say to your players after that one? Uh, get ready for Tuesday. Uh, we've got a FA Cup game on Tuesday, so um, yeah, basically just said, look, cool down, sort yourselves out, um, forget this really, uh, concentrate on Tuesday. Uh, once Tuesday's out of the way, then we can decide what we're going to do um, to face them again uh, next Sunday. Was it tougher than you expected out there or, or not? Uh, no. No, 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 it's exactly what we expected, to be honest. They're a top quality side. As I say, I've been on, been on watched them. I've been on watched them live and then watched a, a few games of theirs, um, footage as well. And yeah, they're a top side. Um, we had a game plan to stop it, and for half an hour it probably did. But then it came down to individual mistakes. Um, you know, we talked about not letting them come through the middle and keeping them out wide. and. A little bit of naivety, a little bit of inexperience that um, we got too tight too many times, and, and I'll, when, we, when we when we weren't able to, uh, and then players with that quality just turn back inside, and and then that's our that's our whole game plan out the window, uh, and they're playing where they want to play and where we don't want them to play. So um, we've obviously got to improve on that uh, individually uh, and collectively, but then we've got to be so much better with the ball. Um, we knew we wouldn't have a great deal of ball, um, but to give it away as cheaply as we did, and, and you know, we, we, you just can't do that against a side of that quality. So yeah, we've got to improve across the board, really. So it was, it was as much your team not performing as it was that they did, if you see what I mean. Yeah, t to an extent. Um, you know, they are a top side, um, and we were never going to stop that. You know, you're never going to stop a team that good for a whole 90 minutes. Um, but we made it too easy for them. You know, I I'm not sure we made a tackle really. Um, you know, so at least you've got to you've got to get in there and make them know that they've got to earn it. Um, we were a bit a bit too too respectful, probably. Um, you know, we did say we, you know respect them, but not fear them. And I think we've probably gone a little bit too far in that. That you know we've stood off, we've let them play, and. Um, they are very good players, um, so they don't need to be made to look any better than they are. Uh, and I think we did that at times today. Just gave them too much respect and too much time on the ball. And um, once you do that with players of that quality, they'll, they'll exploit it. Um, and they did. Um, so we've got to make sure they can't do that as easily um, next Sunday. It seems strange to say this after you've lost 5-0, but your goalkeeper, I thought, had a fantastic game. It, Mary Earps really did come away with it with some credit. Uh, yes, you know she. The, there's always two sides to things. That she made some fantastic saves, um, but I'm sure there'll be other things that she's she's a little bit disappointed with. Some of her distribution, some of her, you know. We talk about we defend from the front, but we attack from the back. So it's about you know it's the footing that she sets us on in terms of how we keep possession. Um, so yes, you know obviously a penalty save early on, fantastic. Uh, two or three other top class saves. It, it could have been. You know, it could have been eight or nine today um, if it wasn't for that. But I'm sure there's also one or two that she's d disappointed to have conceded. You know, I thought she got strong hands to the one just before half time, um, and the one that's come back off the crossbar. I'm sure she'd be disappointed with both of those. Um, but as you say, three or four other great saves that she made, and a penalty save, which you know, she's not supposed to make those. So um, that's a massive bonus for. Her. It's a young team. Um, what will this experience, let's say over the two legs, what will this experience give them as young players? Um, well, hopefully they'll learn a lot from it, you know, and they'll see that that's what top international players, that's how they play. And, you know, and for the first 10 or 15 minutes, really all that Frankfurt did was earn the right to play, um, which I think is something we've got to learn sometimes that, you know, yes, you've got ways that you want to play, and yes, you want to be pretty, and yes, you want to do the right thing. But you have to earn that right to start with. You know, I think um, I think probably in the first five minutes, you know, Jess Fishlock, one of her best mates, I had a James, and she's just gone right through the back of her to win a win a header, um, and that's probably where we're a bit soft. You know, we want to come up there and oh, you know, I saw one or two little bits you know, laughing and joking with mates on the pitch, and there's no such thing as a mate on the pitch. You know, whether it's 1-0 down, whether it's 0-0, whether you're 5-0 down with a minute to go, um, you have to earn the right to play. 
and that's you individually against the person next to you that I don't care whether she's got 100 English, uh, German caps or she's the leading goal scorer in the league or whoever she is, we've got to, no, you're not having an easy, easy ride today and I'm going to win this little individual battle, which I think far too many times across the pitch today we didn't do. So, as I say, we'll put this to one side for the moment because Tuesday now is the most important thing for us. Um, you're always optimistic, but uh, going to Frankfurt to win 6-0 is, um, is probably even beyond my um, realms of optimism at the moment. Uh, so Everton on Tuesday is the most important thing for us now, making sure that the girls all recover properly, prepare for that, uh, a long trip up there, and you know we won't be back till the early hours of Wednesday morning. So they'll have Wednesday off and then prepare to travel to Frankfurt on Friday and, and put on a better show than, than we did today.